Welcome to a fresh week of the rundown. This week, CMP announced a new suicide prevention program. SecDef will host its second worldwide troop talk, and there's a NAV admin to remind you to register to vote. The 21st Century Sailor Office has rolled out a new suicide prevention program called Sailor Assistance and Intercept for Life, or SEL. The SEL program will be an additional resource to supplement mental health treatment. Through SEL, Fleet and Family Support Center counselors will maintain contact with a sailor for 90 days if the sailor exhibits suicidal behavior. This is a voluntary program that is designed to help sailors manage stress by encouraging healthy behavior. The program has started in the Pacific Northwest region first, with the expectation it will be Navy-wide by next summer. For more information on SEL, read our story on Navy.mil. Secretary of Defense Ash Carter will be hosting his second worldwide troop talk September 21st at 1100. SecDef plans to talk on the force of the future and how the DOD plans to bring in the best and brightest and incorporate the latest technology. You can tune in to watch SecDef's speech live at www.defense.gov. The Navy is again reminding you to register to vote for our nation's next president. To register to vote or request an absentee ballot, visit www.fvap.gov. The homepage provides online assistance and important dates regarding upcoming elections. Read NAVADMIN 204-16 for additional information. Finally, the Navy wants you to update your personal and family information in the Navy Family Accountability and Assessment System, or NFAS. NFAS is a system that allows the Navy to account for personnel and family members during times of need. Updating your information and search personnel can be accounted for quickly and accurately. Navy and civilian personnel should complete the update no later than October 1st. To update, visit the NFAS site at www.navyfamily.navy.mil. Log in and update member information under the My Info tab. Also, check out NAVADMIN 200-16 for more information on the NFAS update. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople at gmail.com. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.